and youths against bad morals. The organizers, likewise the convener of Nigeria Chivas Awards 2022, as well as Mr. and Most Elegant Girl in Nigeria 2022, Princess Joy Osusu has called on the government to prioritize and partner with non-governmental organizations who focus on youth engagement and empowerment. While speaking on the purpose of the event organized in Lagos, in an interview, she said they ought to encourage young talents of different skills and kinds. Through of the award, we are looking at people who are doing good, great, people who are impacting others, people who are inspiring others too, to do same thing also. Those are the criteria we are looking at. Yes, you know, I said something, I said the awards platform is all about channeling the youth to a system that is working. So we just felt that if you are telling the youth that this thing works, it's only proper you point them towards a particular people. So the idea of the pageant is bringing, creating a platform for young girls and guys, a platform of relevance, a platform where we can groom them to become prospective leaders in different fields. One of the awardees, Fadi Ilegos, who was present at the award night, expressed his delight and thanked the organizers for the good work of recognition. Okay, I'm one of the awardees tonight for Nigeria and Chivas Award. I look forward to pick that particular category for best spotlight manager, talent manager. Littered or uh, being uh, considered as one of the person that they want to uh, honor tonight, it's such a great privilege because uh, it's just like, okay, people are paying attention to what we are doing at Alpha Pro Limited. So that's it. Okay, God bless the organizers of this award. They've been doing this over the year. I think it's like the eighth edition. So God bless them. They keep doing this. We really appreciate what they are doing. In another development, Honorable Olumuiwa Owadara, a politician who also graced the occasion and joined Nigerians and the youths to make right decisions and participate in the forthcoming election come 2023. This kind of event, this kind of event, my own advice is they should try and invite a lot of young people in politics to attend this such event so they can speak, give them at least maybe five, ten minutes opportunity to speak their mind, to speak. If I'm giving opportunity to speak to now, I'll be speaking to the youth, the way forward, which way forward Nigeria. So my advice, they should invite a lot of young people in politics to speak, to advise. So that's it. Meanwhile, the occasion ended with two contestants as winners out of 12 of Mr. and Most Elegant Girl in Nigeria, showing excitement with gratitude to the organizers of the event. And who God has been choosing today to be the present Mr. Elegant Nigeria, I feel so happy, I feel so excited to be here. It has been God all the way. It has been a stressful journey from the monetary vote to the, to, we did two monetary votes, to the camping, to everything, the taxes. I want to thank the organizers for being faithful to this, for granting us with our, our efforts and not with cheat. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. God bless you. God bless the brand. God bless Nigeria. I feel very happy, very excited. I'm even speechless right now. But I promise to hold my crown so high that even Nigeria and the world at large is going to feel it that my beauty is for purpose. Thank you. The event started with red carpet, stage performances, dances, and award presentations among few mentioned. <laughs> 